How's it going movie fans? The 7th of January 2023 was the 59th birthday of actor and producer Nicolas Cage. A Golden Globe and Academy Award winner, with a style all of his own, Cage's acting career began with a role in a TV movie in 1981, followed by his silver screen debut with Fast Times at Ridgemont High a year later. Since then, along with his wins, Cage has been nominated for a further two BAFTAs, three Golden Globes and an Academy Award. Cage currently has seven projects either announced or in production, with The Old Way and Renfield slated for release in 2023. Here are the Firewall's top 10 Nicolas Cage movies. At number 10 is Pig. In this drama, Cage plays Rob Feld, a truffle hunter who lives a reclusive life in the wilderness with his foraging pig. One night, Rob is attacked and his pig is kidnapped, which forces Rob to hunt down those responsible with the help of Amir, who buys Rob's truffles and sells them to high-end restaurants. The runtime's 92 minutes, and Pig has the foul rating of 7.7 .7 out of 10. At number 9 is The Rock. When Brigadier General Francis Hummel goes rogue, setting up a base in Alcatraz prison, he threatens to launch a nerf gas attack on San Francisco. It is up to the FBI's top chemical weapons specialist, Dr. Stanley Godspeed, played by Cage, and an SAS captain turned convict, to front a counterattack against the general. The run time is 136 minutes, and The Rock has the foul rating of 7.8. At number 8, is Lord of War. Inspired by true events, in this crime drama, Yuri Orlov, played by Cage, partners up with his brother Vitaly as the pair quit their jobs with the goal of making money in the arms trade. But along with their success comes the attention of an Interpol agent who wants to bring them down. The run time is 122 minutes, and Lord of War has the foul rating of 7.8. At number 7 is the unbearable weight of massive talent. In this action comedy, Cage plays a fictionalised version of himself. With his career and personal life on the decline, Cage accepts an invitation from billionaire playboy Javi Gutierrez to be the guest of honour at Javi's birthday party. However, Cage is then approached by the CIA. The run time is 7 minutes, and the unbearable weight of massive talent has the foul rating of 7.9. At number 6 is Kick-Ass. Based on the comic book series of the same name, published by Marvel Comics, Kick-Ass refers to the superhero alter ego of teenager Dave Lazuski, who sets out to be a real-life superhero, but as Dave progresses on his journey, he meets Damon McCready, aka Big Daddy, played by Cage, and his daughter Mindy, aka Hit Girl. The run time is 117 minutes, and Kick-Ass has the foul rating of 8. At number 5 is Moonstruck. Cage received a Golden Globe nomination for Best Actor for his performance as Ronnie Camareri in this romantic comedy drama in which Ronnie's brother Johnny has got engaged and while Johnny's fiance is attempting to reunite the estranged brothers, she falls for Ronnie. The run time is 102 minutes and Moonstruck has the foul rating of 8. At number 4 is Raising Arizona. High McDonough, played by Cage, meets police officer Edwina while she is taking his mugshots in jail. High later proposes to and then marries her. With the pair desperate for a child but unable to conceive or adopt, High and Ed decide to steal a baby from a set of quintuplets. The run time is 94 minutes, and Raising Arizona has the foul rating of 8.2. At number 3, is Adaptation. Cage received BAFTA, Golden Globe and Academy Award nominations for Best Actor for his performance as screenwriter Charlie Kaufman and his freeloading brother Donald. Charlie has been hired to adapt Susan Orlean's non-fiction book The Orchid Thief into a film, however he begins suffering from a case of writer's block. The run time is 115 minutes and Adaptation has the foul rating of 8.4. At number 2 is Leaving Las Vegas. Cage won a Golden Globe and an Academy Award and received a BAFTA Award nomination for Best Actor for his performance as Ben Sanderson, an alcoholic Hollywood screenwriter who moves to Las Vegas with the intention of drinking himself to death. While there, he forms a relationship with a prostitute. The run time is 111 minutes and Leaving Las Vegas has the foul rating of 8.5. At number 1, is Face Off. In this sci-fi action thriller, Cage plays Caster Troy, a sociopathic criminal who falls into a coma before FBI Special Agent Sean Archer can learn the location of a bomb which Troy has placed in Los Angeles. This leads to Archer assuming Troy's identity to get more information, but Troy wakes up and assumes Archer's identity in return. The run time is 138 minutes, and Face Off has the file rating of 8.6. Thanks for watching, next week I'll be counting down the file's top 10 superhero movie franchises, and if you enjoyed this list, please don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe.